What's going on, you beautiful people? This day is just gorgeous. Like, I can't get over how warm it is right now. I mean, like, it's really, really nice. So let me fill you guys in for a second. Right now, it is two o'clock in the afternoon. I just think from my work schedule and working out, my body has just been shot recently. Also, last night we went out and celebrated a little bit for Clark. He passed his nursing program test. I, I, I can't remember what it's called. I think it's called a HESTA or HESPI or I don't know. But it was a late night, which caused me to have a very late start today. <laughs> Not entirely sure what today has in plan. All I know is that. God! All I know is that I'm hitting the gym now. So we're here at Echelon today. It's called like Echelon Health and Fitness. Second time here. First time I uh, put some snaps out there on my Instagram story and my Snapchat story. Hope you guys like that. Last time we did biceps and triceps. What are we hitting today, dude? Uh, we're getting chest. Uh-huh. And we're just gonna get chest, that's it. Just chest? Chest, chest day. So first we're gonna hit the sauna, get our body nice and warmed up, and then we're hitting chest. A track field up here. I need to start running again. I know I couldn't believe this. I only seen this in one other. Look, look at this. It even says walking lane and jogging lane. This place is pretty awesome. Yeah. I'm really liking it so far. And I believe it's only twenty dollars a month. Yeah, I've only ever seen. They got like this massive, like, oh my god, this this place is awesome. I can't even think straight. So I'm gonna go across this, and my good friend Joe's gonna record. Okay. <laughs> All right. Woo. Shit. A little easier than the stairs. Wow. Let him go. <laughs> Come back for more. <gasps> that is so much fun. <laughs> I love monkey bars. 
I gotta join this place. You wanna try? Fight me! That was too fun. Go on, go on, you got it. I don't know when's the last time I did monkey bars, but that was the easy. We've only been here for about an hour and a half, almost two hours now. And it is pouring rain out now. Like how quickly that changed is nuts. But I was just outside because my battery died. I needed to grab a new battery and it's actually still really nice out though. It's just raining and it's dark. I don't know. This nice weather has just completely turned my like my my vibes around yeah, right now <laughs> because I was just so exhausted this weekend and I guess just sleeping in today and getting a good workout in and the weather being so nice like I just feel great just did the ab workout that I showed you guys about a month ago I think it was like maybe three up uh, three vlogs ago Parker what did you think of it man just torn man the side not, planes not torn but like you know how muscles tear to like yeah. rebuild themselves I could feel the rebuilding <laughs> You see that? I'm gonna have an iCard pop up right now. You guys can go click on that. It'll send you straight to that episode where I talked in depth more about the ab workout. Now we're getting food. All right, we decided we're gonna hit Panera Bread. Bye, Nick. Bye, bye. What's up, man? I'm bye. here for you. So just to fill you in, I wanted Chick-fil-A. We all wanted Chick-fil-A. We came to Panera. And Nick just decided after I ordered, that he's gonna go get Chick-fil-A. Got chicken, avocado, gouda cheese, peppers, on like a panini flatbread type of thing, and of course my favorite, creamy chicken and wild rice. And I'm gonna be trying a super fruit smoothie. First time trying it, sounds pretty good. Mmm, that is really good. That was delicious. How was your Chick-fil-A, traders? Still eating it. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> you savage trader. All right, I still got my smoothie. I'm gonna head back to Nick's. I'm gonna get a little edit on. I have a lot of things that I like to do, and sometimes I'm not always doing something very adventurous. I hope you can understand the different types of content that I'm putting out there. It's just me, what I do every single weekend, and I try to bring you guys along. What's going on, you beautiful people? Good morning. Good, good morning. So I passed out, woke up, came home, took a shower, and now we're starting the vlog back up. I'm not hitting the gym today. Um, today's gonna be an off day. I have to get a breakfast sandwich. I've been craving one for the past like two, three days. I'm starving right now, so it's perfect time, right before they close. And then I think I'm picking Nick up to go to Barnes & Noble. I really want to start reading more often. I just feel like since I've been out of school for so long, I graduated back in uh, 2012, if you didn't know that already. And I don't know, it's 2017, it's five years later. And I feel like I need to, it's up to me to educate myself at this point. So I'm gonna start reading a book every now and then. I'm thinking about uh, downloading Audible. I'm thinking about it because I've already gotten rid of my Netflix account. So that money that would usually go to Netflix can now go to Audible. Safety first. I'm just gonna grab a breakfast sandwich, pick up Nick, go to Barnes & Noble. No! It happened again. It happened again. There's no more bagels. So I'm gonna get coffee from Wawa now. Ugh, I'm so upset right now. Sharky's always does this to me. Any day when I go like right before they're about to close, like, I mean, I still had a good half hour before they closed, but they're out of bagels. So I just grabbed myself some Wawa coffee. And luckily right before I even went in, I called Nick to see what he wanted, but he mentioned he was already making breakfast. So, he's about to make me some breakfast. Hello. Good morning. What up, Lean? Good morning, bro. Uh, I got bad news, man. 
There was no French toast bagel or whatever you asked for because they're out of bagels. Bagels. They're out of bagels, That's so. That's the only job. They only have one job. You know to what, Nick? To make bagels. You're making me breakfast now. I already made you breakfast. Oh, that's mine? I forgot to record everything. But... So, where are we going, you said? No, I was saying, did you tell them? Did I tell them? I don't know. Why don't you tell them? Just in case. We're going to surprise you guys. Okay, well, it's not a bop, surprise. Bop, 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 bop. You already told them? Yeah, I told them. Never mind. <laughs> Bags were delicious, billion. bud. They, Thank you. they were no awesome. problem, Frank. No yeah. problem, Frank. He adds like yeah, hot sauce so to it and cheese, and it's so good. And ketchup. And ketchup. And ketchup. While the eggs are cooking. While it cooks. That's yeah. the secret. No, what book are you gonna get? I'm definitely this gonna more. get how to win friends and influence people. But I also want like one or two more, just so that way, like I actually spent some money on it, and it'll make me like. Yo, you just wasted your money. Are you really good? not going to read these? Invested. So it's like I'm more invested and more like obligated to read them. Readers are leaders. I like that. Before we can hit Barnes & Noble, we have to move all this wood onto the pallet, but we have to move the pallet to the side of the house. That's what we're doing now. understand how but it turned into a beautiful day today and we're on our way to Barnes and Noble I'm really excited I haven't read a good book in what am I saying I've never read a full book cover to cover I don't think I've ever done that a day in my life so I'm kind of excited to try this out and really just open myself to learning a little bit more and broadening my mind so like I said Barnes and Noble all right the one thing I do miss is just the smell of a bookstore. It just smells so good, like having a bunch of fresh books around. I don't know why, it's so weird. If any of you guys have any like book recommendations, like please let me know in the comments. That'd be awesome. Yeah, it's Got my books, feeling pretty good. I'm about to drive over to Philly, meet up with my family at my aunt's house for a little dinner, Sunday dinner, and I'm gonna start one of my books. I haven't even decided which one I wanna read first, actually, which is kind of exciting. Um, it's just different for me. I'm trying to cut back on all the TV watching and start doing more positive things with my time. So yeah, 